I have eight friends coming down in <laughs> tomorrow, actually. Tomorrow, in l about 24 hours. Yeah. Over schedule or anything, because really what they want to do is like hang out with each other. I know. I'm just hoping nobody gets arrested. Okay. Nobody gets in trouble, nobody yeah. gets hurt. Okay. Nobody has fun and those three things don't happen. It's Go a win. win. <laughs> okay, very good. It's like we're running a summer camp. <laughs> That's pretty much what I'm thinking. <laughs>Welcome to today's vlog. I'm Jill. This is It's the Donnellys. I am just arriving home from nine days of flying. I haven't seen Ryan in 10 days. Hi, Ryan. There's Carson. Affectionately known as Waz because his last name starts with Waz. So we go with Waz. <laughs> <laughs> Alright you guys, so this is the deal. So I've come home. I'm home for the next five days. It is going to be an action-packed five days. If you've been watching, you know that Katie and I went on a spring break cruise together. Brennan went on a spring break cruise with his friends. And Ryan and I were going to go skiing, but instead we decided, or he decided, we decided they to invite, like everyone, every person in Maryland. Basically. <laughs> I have eight friends coming down in tomorrow actually. Tomorrow in l about 24 hours. Yes. Eight teenage boys are going to descend upon this house and we already have one here, nine, and then Ryan's friends from here. Yeah. Uh, like 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Anyway, it's going to be a teenage boy fast here, senior in high school, except Waz, he's a junior, right? Waz is a junior. He's like an old junior. He's an old junior. He could be a senior, but he just chose not to. Okay. I'd be a senior. Yeah. Uh, Carson, are you looking forward to meeting Ryan's friends from, from Maryland? I am. He's rolling a bunch of about them. Good. I know yeah. they're looking forward to meeting you guys. It's yeah. going to be like a fast. It's going to be... Honestly. It's going to be epic, really. Yeah. So to prepare for all of these teenage boys, um, they eat a lot, as you know. So I have put together a grocery list, and I'm going to go to the grocery store and pretty much clean out the grocery store. Yeah. Yeah. We're going to need a lot of food. For breakfast, I'm just going to whip up like a ton of pancakes, and we'll do cereal and uh, like breakfast burritos or something like that. Mm -hmm. Lunch will probably be out somewhere. Probably but like we're doing like PBJ. Will your friends eat egg salad? You definitely gonna make um, the beef things that you have all the time. What are the beef things? Oh, sure. The beef you always have in there. What's it called? The pork, the shredded yes, pork? pork? Yeah, oh, pulled pork. 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 We were definitely, we're making that for yeah. dinner. Did, have you eaten that before? One time we came here just to eat the pulled pork. Yeah, we did. You like it? Yeah, it's very good. Okay, um, good. We're doing that then, for dinner. Uh, yeah, that for dinner. And then, yeah, no, I, I think pub subs might be the play most okay. of the days. Okay. Chicken poppers. I mean, you haven't come to Florida if you don't eat a pub sub. That's right. At least once. That's right. Um, so, yeah. All right, so on the dinner menu is baked ziti with meatballs, it is pulled pork, it is chili. Oh. So I'm going to go get all the ingredients for that and all the breakfast Wait, ingredients. Wait, garden chicken? I could do that. I'd have to do two things of it because I don't think one will be enough, right? Okay, yeah. Which is fine. I just need to have two cookers to Whatever cook it in. easy enough for you, we'll eat. Okay. And all so right. on the days where we go to the beach, Waz is just going to pull up here. We're going to stuff the bug, stuff the truck, <laughs> <laughs> we're Excellent. That is one of the things is transportation. Transportation for all these guys. We're thinking Uber Teen. We might do Uber Teen. Oh, yeah. We are there. Yes, we are we'll do there. that for yeah. a little bit when we need to. And otherwise, all kinds of people jumping in <laughs> and joining us. So here I go. I'm going to go change and get ready and go straight to the grocery store. Yeah, wait. Oh, can you also grab like burgers and hot dogs? So we, oh, like, right. So we can drill at the pool. Yes. Did you um, make chocolate chip cookies? Did not yet. Oh, dad's gonna be home. He lands at nine. Can you grab flour for me? I'm short on flour. Oh, is that why? Yes, I can do that. Yes, I'll grab it. I need to finish cleaning the room. Okay. Oh, really? You've had all day? I've had all day. But... Let's go take a look and see what it looks like. No. <laughs> oh my. Okay, it's not. Ryan, wait a minute. What? You said you spent all day cleaning. No, I didn't say that. I well, thought, uh, when I talked to you this morning, you said I'm you cleaning. Seen it before I started. <laughs> really? Because so, this is not that great. It'll, it'll it'll be better. Literally by the end of the video, you should walk in here and you'll see it'll be spotless. But I need to clean up the desk, and clean up the floor, clean up the beds, make them. Okay. Them all right, you do that while I go to the grocery store. Yeah. Fantastic. Ready? Right. Break. Ready.
guys, most things have been put away. We have lots of snacks. We have some paper plates and bowls because we will probably go through a lot of those and don't have enough paper plate or enough plates and everything for everybody to have every night and keep washing. This is a little snack bowl we put together. There's some little Debbie oatmeal pies. There's some chewy granola bars, mandarin oranges, um, applesauce, another kind of trail mix bar, all of that. And then in here, we have some ingredients for chili. Behind there is some pork for pulled pork. We have salad, which I'm hoping they eat. I'm responsible for these boys, so I need to make sure they eat some vegetables. Tortilla chip, or tortillas and lots and lots of bread. Let me show you oh, some ricotta cheese. That's for the um, ziti. And I'll tell you what, I honestly, I didn't get everything yet because my, my cart was so full. And I need to go back again. I wasn't able to... I couldn't push another cart and I couldn't put anything else on there. So I need eggs and milk and that kind of stuff. But these, this is all of the, um, this is all the baked goods. So we have another loaf of bread. We used to have some Hawaiian rolls. I'm trying to, going to try to make the ham and cheese sliders. We have hot dog buns and hamburger buns for hot dogs and hamburgers. And actually I need to get more hamburger buns because we'll use that for the pulled pork sandwiches as well. Here's all the cans, all the canned goods. I got peanut butter and jelly and canned goods. Two whole things of those for um, the beans and then the chili. What else? Whole thing of ramen noodles because I know they like ramen noodles. This is for the ziti. All kinds of cereal. We got Frosted Flakes, Cheerios and uh, frosted mini wheats. I already have a ton of pancake mix, but I bought more anyway because I forgot I had a ton of pancake mix. So we'll see if we can return that. But anyway, um, applesauce, peach iced tea, which Ryan loves because you know what? I didn't want to just do a bunch of sodas and I'm, I'm not a fan of soda. I think it's bad. I'm not, peach iced tea is not that much better, but they really should be drinking just water. But anyway, I got tons of water. Actually, I'll show you that. Tons of water bottles and um, some Capri Sun just because I didn't want to be like a mean mom, but really like water is really what they should be drinking. I did not do soda. Whoa. Oh my gosh. There we go. So Ryan unpacked all the waters and there's the Capri Suns. That's Mike's. He drinks Diet Pepsi. I'm not even going to comment on that. But anyway, this is the rest of the drinks for now. We'll probably have to go back and get some halfway through. I'm not, I, I really don't know what to expect in terms of how much these guys will be hanging out and eating and that kind of thing but i did not want to be without food so i do have to go back tomorrow to the grocery store and pick up just a few more items we got toilet paper and i just want to check in on ryan and see how he's doing in his room how you doing bugs i'm texting everyone for oh um what are you telling them to what like what to bring Oh, perfect. Okay. Good idea. Yeah. So do you want to um, give us a rundown of the schedule, what you think we'll be doing? Um, like your, what you told me before about. Yeah. So basically we're going to um, go to the beach the most of the time. Well, that would be probably like two days, maybe three days. We go they're here, and they're here a total of five, right? Five days. Five okay. days. Um, and so uh, Monday when they get in, I just want to show them around everywhere. I'll show them like my school, uh, downtown, uh, the mall, everything like that. And then um, towards uh, the middle of the week, we're gonna be at the beach. Uh, we'll bring the cool cabana and uh, we might grill at the beach. I don't know, we'll, we'll see. Um, watch the sunset and everything. And then we're gonna have some pool days and uh, go down. There's some uh, sand volleyball courts I wanna go play volleyball at. And uh, it's just gonna be a great time. Yeah, yeah. excellent. Yeah. Ryan was telling me that he didn't want to um, over schedule or anything because really what they want to do is like hang out with each other but we talked about the fact that florida is different from maryland so we wanted to show them some florida things pop stroke is one of the cool things i think they should go to pop stroke this is just my thing yeah. it's this really really cool if you guys don't know what pop stroke is look it up p-o-p-s-t-r-o-k-e it is um basically like miniature golf on steroids it is the coolest place ever and they don't have it up north um, so I think that would be a super fun thing for them to do. But anyway, I'm not, we're not going to, we both agree. We're not going to force anything. And they might just sit up here and play video games and then go out in the backyard and play football and that kind of stuff. Right, Ray? Yeah. 
Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, he's texting me now. All right, so stay tuned. We will um, show you Ryan's room when it's ready and everything as it gets ready because tomorrow, actually the first guest comes tomorrow at 10 a.m. Mm -hmm. And But tomorrow's Palm Sunday, so we have to figure out church and all that. So I think what, maybe what we'll do is tell, tell him it will be a little bit late to pick him up. Okay. And we'll figure that out. And then everybody else comes tomorrow night. Um, they're all flying down. <laughs> all right, one by one, everybody's coming home. Michael John. I was telling everybody, first of all, welcome home. Thank you. I just went and picked him up at the airport. Mm. We came in on two separate flights today. Because mm -hmm. Mike, <laughs> very funny. Mike was visiting his mom for her birthday up in Rochester. That was very kind of you. 87 years old, I got some video. Oh, you did? Mm -hmm. Oh, let's cut to that right now. That? Yeah. Okay, today's a special day. It is March 22nd, and that is a special day because it is my mom's birthday today, so. I'm up here in Rochester and uh, here to celebrate with her. So she turns 87 today and she's doing great and we love her. We affectionately refer to her as Nani. And uh, we're gonna, I'm gonna surprise her with some balloons now and my sisters and nieces and nephews are gonna join us. Uh, Jill's flying and the kids are in school, uh, but we're gonna celebrate anyway. And I think they're gonna call and say happy birthday. So get the chance to comment below say happy birthday to Nani she's a special lady everyone absolutely loves her she's still cutting her own lawn at 87 and she's a blessed woman with great health and uh, great mind so love you Nani let's go surprise her okay this is one of the problems with Nani she's always moving and shaking and um, she's not home <laughs> I didn't tell her I was coming because she'd say, nah, don't come, don't come. So now I'm, I'm out here. It's freezing cold. It's snowing. And uh, I have no nanny, no mom. So I'm sure she's out running around, uh, keeping busy. And uh, I think I'm just going to hang out here and wait till she rise. There's nanny. She's going to win the lottery on her uh. 87th birthday. Happy <laughs> birthday, nanny. <laughs> win, win, win. No, no, I'm not going to win. You know why? I know right away. I could tell from these numbers. Oh, really? Yeah. Is there like a pattern for scratch-offs? Uh, well, you know what? The first number I did was 27. One of the winning numbers is 26. When it's that close, I get a lot of close ones. Oh, oh. and so they try to get you to keep I, going. Yeah. Because they figure if you're that close. I, 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 look, see? This number is seven. Would I have an eight in the nine or the two of winning? Okay. Huh? I, I already I know right away. But, okay. I have a 36. Winning number is 35. Oh. That happens every time. That's how they get you, Ma. Yep. <laughs> oh, yummy. <laughs> oh. Oh. Well, I don't know if you're going to like it. Oh, I love I it. I never made it before. Oh, I'm sure it's delicious. It looks good, I'm but sure it's, it's very flat. There's Aunt Jackie. <laughs> what are y'all doing? You doing work? A little bit of work. Who's on the lights? I'm on the lights. No, you'll see it. Feel it, y'all. Okay, ready. One, two, and one, two, three. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Nani. Happy birthday to you. How old are you? <laughs> Yay! Yay! Happy birthday, Nani. Happy birthday. I haven't seen it yet, so I can't comment on it. However, you guys just saw that, and I'm sure it was delightful. I'm so happy that Mike got a chance to do that and be with his family. I'm sad that I didn't get to go. Um, but Mike, we were I was telling everybody about how um, Ryan's friends are going to be visiting. So we have eight teenage boys. What do you think about that? I know. I'm just hoping nobody gets arrested. Okay. Nobody gets in trouble. Nobody yeah. gets hurt. Okay. Can we have fun and those three things don't happen? It's, it's a, a win. win. <laughs> okay, very good. It's a win. I'll be here the first four nights, but after that, then I'm leaving. So you get the last two nights. Sorry. I can work. <laughs> I'll have you all, all prepared, all set up. We'll set them in a routine. 
We've got a curfew. Everybody has their shower towel. Everybody, I have laid out. Everybody show. Well, I'll, I'll show this with you guys before I go to bed. But everybody has their shower towel. We have places where everybody's going to put each of their suitcases. We have um, um, plugs for each of their cell phones so they can plug in their phones. It's like we're running a summer camp. <laughs> That's pretty oh, much what I'm thinking. <laughs> so hang out with us, you guys, while we see how this whole thing turns out. Right, guy. You made the beds. You kind of cleaned your desk, Please. the floor. I mean, no, I mean, really, you did. There's just a lot of stuff over there, so, but it looks it's really organized. good. It is organized. Look at this. I'm very proud of you. So you made all the beds except one. But you can go up there and can do that. It is tall. I know. I need my invention. I have an invention, you guys. I'll tell you about it later. But anyway. All right. So look at. We, the bean bag now? Uh, no, I would put it in here and then open it up at night, you know? So they can see what your room looks like. You know what I mean? Be like, oh, this is what my room normally looks like. <laughs> okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Do you think they care? I think they do. Um, we're, I mean, we're guys. So right. We're okay. um, but yeah, I'm super excited. So Nathan's getting in tomorrow morning. And then we'll go pick up all the boys tomorrow night. Fantastic. Yeah. All right, I'm going to go to bed because I know I need a lot of sleep. I got a lot of cooking to do tomorrow. Fair enough. Mass in the morning and then move along. Yeah. So what are you most looking forward to? Instead of saying what made you happy, we'll say what are you most looking forward to doing with the boys? Oh, that's a great question. Uh, just being at the beach. Like once we go to the beach, get everything set, and I just sit down in my chair, like it's just going to be such a great feeling. With you guys. Yeah. It's gonna be awesome. I'm excited for your guys to meet your other guys and your other guys to meet yes, your guys. Totally. So your Florida friends to meet your Maryland friends and your Maryland friends to meet your Florida friends. You think they're just gonna start fighting? No, 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 no. I think they're gonna like you high five and hands. making fun of you. I think that's the, the, the you're the common person, so they'll just start like busting on you because that's what they know. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, they do bust on me. So yeah, yeah. Uh, but um, uh, yeah, it's gonna be it's gonna be fun. It is. You guys, I hope you can hear over the fan. We got the fan on. All right, you guys. Well, thank you. So oh, thanks, Ryan. Thanks so much for watching us prepare for Ryan's spring break. Stay tuned for all these videos. We're going to film it for you guys, and it's going to be fantastic. Uh, so, over these next few days, look out. And, yeah. Excellent. Combo, I'm you guys have a good day. See you tomorrow.